This is final. So whoever wins this gets to play against me. Yep. But well, looks like, like we need to take the game. Uh, let's see. Do you know which one of these is Bubbles? The level three is Bubbles. Okay. Cool. And try the right side. Anyways, looks like we're getting straight into first game. I wolf ditto on Battlefield. Yep. Uh, I'm honestly not super knowledgeable about Project M, but yeah, from what I've seen, it's just like the ultimate glass cannon, ridiculously high fall speed, a moderate recovery at best, but yeah. the combos. Yeah, he has some really good combos. His shine sets them up like right in front of them, so that you can just like do an aerial. I heard earlier that apparently he has a wave shine thing on the box. It's pretty crazy with yeah. uh, considering Fox's just general attributes. Yeah. It's probably because he's probably it's probably because he's so heavy and he has such a fast call speed. Might even be able to do it on Wolf if he can do it on Fox. Alright. Well, if so, I'll uh, we'll just see it this time. But uh, as we were talking about earlier, Wolf, er, Wolf just carrying the other one apart. Yeah. Both stocks. The first stock was lost extremely quickly and the second one wasn't too far behind. Yeah. Oh, them shines. Indeed. Yeah. This is this is anyone's game, really. It's very even, only like 30% apart. That's yeah. maybe one combo. Probably yeah. uh, a combo will probably be And then uh, a combo with Wolf can end anyway. It can end with them getting out of it. It can end with them getting killed. It can end with the other person killing you. Yeah. It's so that, that seems to be kind of how it works. Uh, do you know if scarring is still on this game? Where you're underneath the ledge over here, and you side me, and you like kind of flip through the stage? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. Uh, no. I don't know. Uh, nice platform pressure there. He uh, actually ends up knocking him off, so he can just hit you up with him. As we see right there. Oh! Unfortunate air dodge there. Yeah, air dodge on impact. Mm -hmm. Don't you just hate it when that happens? Oh. Yeah. He, I think he just got the shine on the laser. It yeah, didn't actually planked. reflect. Planked it. Mm. Oh. Uh, spikes him, but he didn't actually manage to get off stage in time. Otherwise, that could have been an extremely early stock. Yeah. Man, Wolf's Snare is just, it looks like such a great combo filler move. Yeah, it's kind of like Fox is down now. Yeah. Just a bunch of really quick multi-hits. Yeah. That leads into Shine. Yep. Which can lead into more stuff because... Yeah. Because Wolf's Shine just gets into Shine, stuff. you get the world. Yep. Speaking of Shine... Oh! Oh! oh. And is that, that's not going to be game. He yeah. manages to just barely make it back. Ops for a down air as it's back here. Makes back once again, but I don't. Yep, he's not coming That's back game. for that one. Bubbles will take the game first one. game. Let's see how things come out for the second one. Looks like Antic's going to be switching to his melee main of the Ice Climbers. So that should be interesting. Though he isn't technically character locked until the stage has been selected. Yes. Oh, looks like they're but just going straight into it. Final destination. Uh, it didn't work out for him so well in his last match in melee, but let's see if it goes better for him this time. Ooh, gets the jab reset uh, to grab. Doesn't get that much off of the grab, but does get some, some solid damage. grabs. Oh, oh yeah. That down smash. Oh, 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 oh. he's saying oh. Blizzard Wall. Yeah. Oh. Uh, both forward smash being a two-hit move, they yeah. also move forward quite right a ways. I feel like that's just such a great tool. Oh, doesn't quite really manage to make it back to the stage. Opting to take the opportunity to I guess, just get damage on Nana and actually end up He's trying to kill Nana, but looks like he could have also Maybe he a... thought that he actually had Nana dead there, but he yeah. didn't. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Just barely made Sweet it to spot. avoid the uh, ice. I don't actually know the name of that move. The ice blocks from the ice is going to be. Yeah. He was able to get the punish on the recovery, but does punish the ledge gun up on it. Yeah. Oh, it looks like starting this, uh, he kind of went through the stage there. 
Uh, I feel like that's a pretty decent mix-up. So, landing on it, I would assume it's very laggy. Antic is like a full stock ahead. And he's just increasing his lead right now. Looks like Final Destination uh, worked out pretty well for him as a counter pick. Yep. Opportunity to get in. Yep, just anything right now. Ooh, gets the spot. Does split up both the climbers. Uh, Nana is dead. Oh, Alright. So Ooh, the multi shines. Ooh, and he does successfully get the He does successfully get the punish on the recovery this time. Converts it into another stock. With that, stocks are even, and after that combo, uh -oh. percentages are not that this far is not apart. Good. Oh, oh, oh. It takes it around. Yep, he's, he doesn't want to lose this lead. It's like, you're doing this, get down smash. Yep. Uh, Bubbles has been doing pretty well whenever he actually manages to split up the climbers, which he seems to be doing an alright job of. Oh, and the fear kill. He moved back so that he wouldn't get hit by the punish, but oh. ended up going back too far to grab the ledge. But, yeah. It was a pretty terrible situation either way, though, honestly. Down air to shine. Popping him up. Juggling him, uh, this fall speed working against him here. I don't know what that was. I'm assuming either tech air or maybe the ICs actually have a decent power for that lead. But the down smash will take it. Yep. So with that, I see down smash. Down smashing, so you beat Wolf's down smash. Yep. Uh, looks like we're going into game three of this set. Also, if those of you in the chat can tell me how the stream is doing at the moment, give us a zero. Yeah, yeah. Then that would be great because I'm hoping it's not lagging, but I can't actually see it from here. I have to go play Smash 64. All right. So it looks like it's going to be just the commentary for now, then. Okay, so getting into this, looks like we're going back to Battlefield, however, Antic is opting to stay the Ice Climbers. It did seem to work out for him significantly better last time. Blake and Pineapple, who won? Okay, Mag have you fought Pineapple yet? So you have fought him, or you're about to? Okay. Alright, so sorry about that, guys, but... Anyways, getting back to this match. Uh, percents are fairly even, both are still in their first stock. I would assume this is going to be a bit slower paced match than the last one we saw on Battlefield. But, I mean, stocks... I feel like Wolf is definitely a stock closer, just from what little I've seen of the character. Manages to both avoid the forward smash at the ledge. It does have some decent range from what it looks like, but he also managed to actually grab the ledge this time. I think he learned from his last fair kill. And that bubbles to take the first stock. Wolf's back air, uh, at least from how I know it from Brawl, is such an amazing good spacing tool. Like, definitely one of the best moves in the game. But it won't save him from that down smash there. And with that, things are even right back up. Wolf just kind of dancing around and Xyces, not really wanting to get caught by a grab, but he's still trying to figure out a way in. Antic, on the other hand, definitely forcing an approach and getting some nice stuff off of his throws. The up air uh, knocks Bubbles off stage, does manage to get back to a charge of, oh, and the, he read it just right as the shield dropper. Maybe that shield poked, honestly, he couldn't tell. He had the patience to just stand there, like, you're going to stay here shielding too. Ooh, misses the bear. Does manage to get, uh, Popo back off stage again, though. Oh, and an unfortunate SD. He pulled back too far to actually reach the ledge. Shine, 
trying to split up both climbers, however, they were both just slightly out of range. They both get on the floor. This match staying extremely close, though. Uh, Bubbles has taken a slight lead just by not losing the stock. There, I guess. But he still has one of the slightest of leads right now. Just like 14. Right now. But this is still very definitely anyone's game. This is the last game of the set. He goes for this forward smash, uh, which but doesn't actually end up punished for it. Ooh, the up air! If he spaces it just right so they split up both the ice climbers, doesn't actually finish the job with Nana though. Uh, went to Edgar Popo, but didn't actually manage to convert it. Sometimes that's what you need to do though, so you're trying to go for the higher reward plays, even if it's a bit more difficult. Ooh, the first pair misses, and then the shield comes up just in time to block the forward smash, but it's like on the ground. Up smash will take Nana, forward smash will take Coco. With that, Bubbles is sitting at probably the biggest lead we've seen in this game so far. But he's still definitely at a percent where he can kill. Guys, I feel like we are about to see. Yep. So just like that, Antic evens things straight back up. It's being a very close set. Going for the up airs, because this looks like some very strong, very safe, and very rewarding platform pressure, especially with uh, Wolf's fall speed and then the low lag once out cancel. It's also handy that when it hits correctly, it splits up both the climbers. However, Antic doing a good job of getting off the platforms, uh, just kind of splitting up. Oh, oh, and the laser will end up gimping Antic. The winner is. Bubbles the game. 